Buckingham Sins, it's me again, Mr. Payne, and welcome to our super fun nutrition game. What food group does that belong in? All right, now before we get started, okay, again, think about the five main food groups that we learned about, okay? Our first one we have is fruits. Remember, fruits can be juicy and they're typically sweet, okay? We got fruits. Next one, we have grains. Hmm, what comes to mind when I hear that word grain? I think of bread, okay, grains, remember, grains. Next one we have is vegetables. Ooh, vegetables are so good. They're great as a side dish. Remember, vegetables are grown, vegetables. We also have protein. Ooh, when I hear that word protein, and you hear that word protein, think meat, okay, protein, remember? Makes you strong, okay? Helps strengthen your uh, muscles. Protein, really good. And then last, we have dairy. Dairy, remember, dairy's gonna help strengthen your bones, okay? Calcium. Uh, remember dairy? What does Buckingham serve that goes in the dairy category? Milk, okay? Five main food groups, okay? I'm gonna hold one up. I'm gonna give you a couple seconds to guess where it goes, and you'll see if you're correct or incorrect, okay? All right, let's get ready for our first food. Let's go with chicken. Hmm, chicken. I'll give you a couple seconds. All right, chicken. If you said chicken goes into the protein category, you are 100% correct. Great job. And it's not staying up there. There we go. Chicken's in the protein category. Great job, Buckingham students. All right, next one. Are you ready? Next one we have is broccoli. Hmm. Which category or food group do you think broccoli's gonna go into? All right, broccoli. If you chose vegetables, you're right. Broccoli is going to go into that vegetable food group. Okay, broccoli. Great job, Buckingham students. Oh, uh, we got another one. Let's think. How about crackers? What do you think crackers? Which food group do you think that belongs in? Hmm. Tough choice. Crackers belong in the grain category, the grain food group. All right, great job, Buckingham students. Let's get another one. How about cherries? Where do you think cherries belong? Hmm. Cherries are gonna go in the fruit category, the fruit food group. Cherries, we'll put that right there. All right, Buckingham students, what's next? Ooh, I got a good one. How about cheese? Hmm, cheese, what do you think? Fruits, grains, vegetables, protein, or dairy? If you said Dairy, you're 100% correct. We'll put that right there in the dairy category, okay? Um, Buckingham students, we have time for a couple more, okay? We're gonna go with a very special and difficult item, okay? How about tomatoes? Oh my goodness, tomatoes. I think it could go into two. It's my opinion. What do you think, tomatoes? Tomatoes. Tomatoes are definitely not protein. They're definitely not grain. Definitely not dairy. Is a tomato a fruit or a vegetable? Hmm. If you said fruit or vegetable, I'm gonna give it to you. Technically, a tomato is a fruit, 
because of the seeds, okay? Technically, a tomato is a fruit. However, nutritionists from around the world are gonna say it's a vegetable, okay? So, we'll give it both, tomato. I'm gonna put it right in between both. Hopefully it stays there. Um, we got time for at least one more. All right, Buckingham students, let's get started. What do you think about this one? Nuts. I think we talked about this before. Nuts. Hmm. What food group do you think nuts are gonna go into? Is it grains? Dairy? How about protein? If you said protein, you are 100% correct. And it's not staying up there, okay? So we're gonna put it right here. It's protein, okay? That magnet's not, not liking me. Um, Buckingham students, we got time for one more last one, okay? One more last one. And I told you, this is one of my favorites. Hmm. How about corn? Hmm. Buckingham students, corn. Would it go on the grains? Would it go on the protein? Dairy? Vegetable? If you said vegetable, you are 100% correct. Great job. Corn's definitely going to go on that vegetable food group, okay? I'll put it right down here. Buckingham students, I hope you had fun. I hope you learned a little bit about food groups, okay? But we are out of time. Uh, Buckingham students, I hope you enjoyed learning about nutrition. I am very passionate about nutrition. Um, I find it very interesting, okay? It's your, nutrition kind of ties into your body. It's very important on what you're eating uh, every day, okay? Buckingham students, again, keep up the hard work. I am so proud of you, okay? Don't forget to keep reading. Don't forget to keep up with your math, okay? Keep up with uh, writing as well. It's so important. Practice writing. Practice writing stories, okay? This is Mr. Payne. Hope to see you soon.